Hi there! My name is Debbie Varner. My husband Tom and I have been going to CAC for over 10 years now and we are missing seeing you guys every week. We're involved in different ministries and different things and we just miss being at church and seeing everybody. I am so thankful for these vlogs that we can check in and say hello. I am a stay-at-home mom who is now doing the homeschooling thing. So I'd like to introduce you to my family quickly. Here is my first grader, Hi. Taylin. And my four and a half year old Hi. Adrian. Here's my second grader, Tessa, and our fifth grader, Hi. Ashlyn. Now, I am a teacher by trade, but I am by no stretch of the imagination a homeschooling mama. But here we are. We are all going through this together. Um, all of us are experiencing different things as we go through this, but we're all going through this for the first time. So I just want to encourage you to stay positive and to keep in mind that our kiddos are watching everything that we are doing. They are watching how we react to things, what we say, and um, what we do. So just stay steady for them and stay positive. I know every school district is doing different things for their students to help learn and grow for the rest of the year. I know our school district's doing a lot of things online. My fifth grader can work a lot on her own, and my second grader and my first grader need a little bit more of my one-on-one -on -one attention. So we just take some different times and switch each day to do our routines differently. Sometimes I work with my first grader, and other times I work with my second grader. So just find what works best for you and get into the groove of what works. Um, I know the teachers and the staff and the technology um, workers behind the scenes are doing an amazing job to help us along this way to make it as easy as possible. But besides the schoolwork that they're they're offering, there are so many other things that we can do. Think outside of the box and, and do something differently, not just going outside and doing some fun things, which is an amazing opportunity for us to do, especially with the weather breaking. But also, if your child is interested in something, ask them what they want to learn about and maybe do a little bit of research on it. Maybe not a research project, but maybe just talk about it over one of your meal times. My sister and I started doing a Bible study together with our kiddos right whenever this all started. And let me tell you, it has been really great. We're doing the Priscilla Shirer Armor of God. And what's really neat about it is that they have different workbooks leveled to the different kids' ages. So it's really great because you're all working on the same thing but it's at a different age level for each of them. So it's at their pace. So it's really great. Um, there are so many online studies that you can do uh, different options through different websites, but also our website, um, the church's website has, um, Right Now Media, if you've never gone to Right Now Media before, Right Now Media has so many resources available to us, whether you want something for yourself or for your kids or to do together as a family, which is something I honestly really, really encourage you to do. But so on the website, click on resources. Under that is Right Now Media. If you don't have an account, set yourself up for an account and you can do that right through the website. That that I really encourage you to do, to do that. Also, the YouVersion app, you can get on your phone or on a tablet. Those have some really great studies on there as well. All in all, I just ask um, just for prayer for our family. We'll be praying for your family. Just stay positive. Encourage one another around you. Reach out to those that you may be thinking of that you, um, that you know are not as fortunate to you to have a family near you, but uh, just focus on God, dig into his word, grow together as a family, create amazing memories. Our kids are going to remember this time. So I just encourage you to make these memories worthwhile for them so that they can look back at this COVID-19 and not just think of all these awful, horrible things, but they think about praying for others, lifting others up, reaching out to others and growing together as a family. Love you guys. Hope you have a great day. And we'll see you soon. Thank you so much for watching our video. If you wouldn't mind giving us a like, follow, and subscribe on our Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube accounts. Also, a share on Facebook could have a family or friend see this video too. We'd really appreciate that. All this information can be found in the description below or on our website at butlercc.org. We'll see you next time.